And Lou, we were in the courtroom. No cameras or recordings were allowed. Enough people turning out to attend the around two hour sentencing that the courtroom and an overflow courtroom were filled. We heard from Mark Ridley Thomas himself. He addressed the court. He apologized to his family, colleagues and constituents. And afterwards, one of his sons making a brief statement. We are deeply disappointed in the current state of affairs related to proceedings in Mark Ridley Thomas' trial. Ridley Thomas's son Sinclair speaking on behalf of family outside court following the sentencing of his father, longtime politician Mark Ridley Thomas, to 42 months in federal prison. This whole case has been devastating for the supervisor. While prosecutors had pushed for six years prison time, defense attorneys had instead asked for probation. In court, Ridley Thomas said while he disagrees whether he crossed the line into illegal conduct, he acknowledged he should be at the end of the spectrum where there would be little, if any, question of unlawfulness. As Dr. Ridley Thomas stated in court today, he deeply regrets that his actions caused anybody to question that he crossed the line. A federal jury in March convicted Ridley Thomas of seven felonies, bribery, conspiracy, honest services, mail fraud, and four counts of wire fraud. There must be accountability for those who betray the public trust. This is why today's sentence of Mark Ridley Thomas is so important. The politician sentenced in a corruption scheme when he was an L.A. County supervisor. It involves sending $100,000 from a campaign committee to USC and directing a dean to funnel the money to his son Sebastian's nonprofit. Ridley Thomas voting to renew a lucrative USC contract with the county that dean was pushing him for. Mr. Ridley Thomas was an immensely powerful politician who chose to violate the law to benefit his son. The judge calling his crime serious, saying he has not shown remorse and political corruption must be deterred. It's a very sad day. Mark Ridley Thomas was one of the greatest public servants in the history of this state. Ridley Thomas is 68 years old. He was on L.A. City Council when he was indicted. He's now been ordered to self-report to prison November 13th. His lawyer saying they do respect the court's decision, but argued there are legal issues they plan to address on appeal. That's the latest live in the newsroom. Lou, I'll send it back to you.